M mode measurement of the left ventricle, you need a parasternal long or short axis view. You can actually do it from both. I will show you how to do it from the short axis. So the first thing you have to look into is if the ventricle is really round. This is important uh, for the reasons already mentioned. So once you have a nice view of the left ventricle, you will put the M mode exactly through the middle of the left ventricle and optimize the image so that you have a very good contour and then freeze the image and perform the measurement of the septum at diastole so we have the biggest width of the left ventricle shortly before the QRS complex starts so this is where you would start with your M mode measurement of the septum. Then you would measure the end diastolic diameter, the posterior wall. Now all these measurements are diastole, and you would then perform the same measurements at systole for the end systolic diameter for the posterior lateral wall. And uh, these are the, the measurements, basically, that you would perform.